members of the state's legislature's powerful budget writing committee are hearing public comment. A joint Finance Committee is in the process of reviewing Governor Scott Walker's proposed two-year budget. In a meeting at State Fair Park, the governor also visited the area to tout his spending plan. Pete Cervantes reports. Before the Joint Finance Committee sends the state budget onto the full legislature, people here in Milwaukee County wanted to weigh in. They showed up bright and early, filing into the Wisconsin Expo Center at State Fair Park to speak about Governor Scott Walker's two-year budget proposal. It increases funding to K-12 through schools. We're really pleased to see some restoration of funding that is much needed by our schools. But members of the Wisconsin Public Education Network want even more and don't want any strings attached like compliance with the state's Act 10 law on collective bargaining for public workers. We want to show our support for public schools. We want to show our support for um, children across the state, uh, urban and rural from one side of the state to the other. We're making historic levels. There's never been more money put into K-12 through education than ever before. After a speech at the Together for Children conference in Milwaukee, Walker said his budget benefits all public school districts equally, not a select few. Whether it's in Milwaukee, or it's in rural school districts across the state, they get additional funds on top of that. The Joint Finance Committee can make changes to the budget before the full legislature votes on it this summer. Today's hearing runs until 6 p.m. At State Fair Park, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4. And today's hearing is one of six total scheduled across the state.